Welcome to the fifth in our series of tips and tricks videos for the Applied Biosystems TrueMark MSI Analysis Software. In this short video, we'll cover how to add comments, approve samples, and export results. For the purpose of this video, I'll be logged in as a director. First, I'll show you how to accept samples and add comments. Select a batch from the home screen. Click on the batch name in blue and open the batch details. Click on the Specimen Data tab and then on the Review tab. Users with the appropriate permission can accept the sample by clicking Accept to make it available for final review and final approval. As you approve samples, they will show as Under Review for its review status. To move on to the next sample, choose it from the Sample drop-down menu at the top right or click the arrows left or right. Here in the Review tab, you can also add notes to a specific sample by selecting Add Comment. Type in your comment and click Save. This will attach that comment to the sample, along with an audit history of who entered the comment and when. When you add a comment, that sample will show as Under Review for its review status. After all comments have been added and samples have been accepted, a user with the appropriate permission can do a final review of each sample and then check the box next to Ready for Approval. So here, I've added my comment. Now I will click Accept to accept the sample and then check the box next to Ready for Approval. This then changes the review status to Ready for Approval. Once all samples have been made ready for approval, a user with the appropriate permission can perform the final approval. To do so, click on the Batch Summary tab and confirm all the samples in your batch say Ready for Approval in the Review Status column. To perform a final approval of all, click on Approve in the top right. A dialog box opens, asking you to provide your username, password, and any additional comments. Fill that in and click Approve. Once complete, you'll see a note that says specimens approved successfully. Click OK. Now you can see that the review status column of all samples states approved. Now we'll demonstrate how to generate a PDF file of your data analysis results. From the Batch Summary tab, click PDF Report. Select if you want a batch summary level or a specimen level report, the latter being more detailed. If you choose the specimen level report, you must use the checkboxes on the left side of the screen to choose which ones you want reported. Once the PDF is generated, the software will notify you and you can click to open the report folder. Lastly, I'll show you how to export your data analysis results. Again, from the Batch Summary tab, click Export Results and choose between three formats, Again, if you choose either of the specimen options, you must use the checkboxes on the left side of the screen. The software will notify you when your export files are ready, and you can click to open the export folder. And that concludes our video. Don't forget to check out our other videos in this series to learn more about the TrueMark MSI Analysis software.